So, following the video of the fakey Wagos and the actual Wagos, let's do a couple of tests to find out which one is actually better. Well, the first test, I'm gonna do a tug test. So, we've got a bit of 1.5 cable, and we will terminate them both to the same length, because Wago do come with a little bit on the edge, telling you how much to chop off the terminating. There we go, that side. So, I'm gonna put it in the middle one. Let's get rid of that. So the brown, which is alive, that is a bit long, so let's chop it down. But they're both the same. So just making sure that is the length which Wago sort of say you've got to put in there. We'll put that in there. Hang about, hang about, hang about. So I'm going to poke it up through the table. So then put the Wago on the brown and then the fake Wago on the blue. Give them a tug, they're on there. They're both good on there and probably that's as much as a tug you're gonna get. But let's see, giving it a bit more force, who wins? The Wago gave way first. Right, well, let's be fair. And change them around to the fake Wago to the Wago on the blue. And then both in here, my foot on this. And let's try it with the five. Give him Wago a chance here. This is the five of the fake ones. Put them in there. Tug test won't come off. Tug test. Flipping hell. Let's come off again. I'm gonna get another Wago. I don't know whether that's any good. Five on there. Tug test ain't going nowhere. So then get them in. Both of them. Who's gonna go first? Way you go. So then now let's have a look to see what's inside them. Pull them to bits, shall we? Right. To see what is inside, see what the buzz bars are like. So that come apart quite easy. But the plastic does feel better on a way go. And it's a bit tougher. I think more durable, even though we are ripping it to bits. Ow. There we go, the levers do come to bits, come off. That's that little bit in there. So this little terminals in there of what they use for the connectors inside. So yeah, quite good. So then, look at that. That's all in bits now. That's the way go, two, two, one. So let's try the fake one, Chinese knockoff. Right, yeah, it comes a bit a bit easier, I think. Oh, yeah, there we go. 
Right, so we've got that little point in there. It looks like there's not as much of a connection, but yep, these levers come to bits quite easy. And that is like the buzz bar for it inside, which is similar to the Wago. So China's made a good copy, I'll give it that. And that's the destruction of them. They both come to bits the same. Now, what about working with other brands? Whisker box. Whisker have brought a box out. And they say you can fit Wagos inside. So let's have a look. Yeah, these little ones, they're not going to fit. They're a bit... If you do a comparison... The fake way goes are a little bit fatter. See at the end. Yeah, they haven't got as much in there. You can't get them in. They don't fit. You can't get them in there. I'm not going to bother trying. But then the way you go, let's have a look. I know these fit because I have put them in before. But look, yeah, see, you can put them in there, two terminal box. So basically the whisker box works with Wago. You can take them out. What about the Wago for the Wago box? This is important as well. Because it fits in there nicely. Look at that, slides in and slides out. They're built for them. They're built by Wago for Wago. So yeah, we know they fit. I know you can get them all in there at a nice, convenient size. So there we go, and shut the lid up very easily and nicely, and it sits in there. But then, what about if you buy the box, but you want to put the fake way it goes in? So then, you get these. Yeah, they go, they go in, they do go in there, I'll give it that. That one goes in there. Yep, that'll go in. The threes go in. Let's try the fives. Oh, I have to leave the five till last, you know. Because they're a bit fatter. But yes, they go in. I'll tell you what, when they go in there, they're staying there. But then can you shut the lid? You can. With a bit of a struggle, but you can shut the lid. A bit more difficult to get out. So you've got to get a screw on to get them out. Oh. Then what about the Quick Fix JB4s? Well, these are designed for Wagos. So I think when you buy Wagos, they fit with everything. These, unfortunately... Don't. They're not. They're a bit big. And just don't fit in there. Let me try. Like, you, you can actually get one in if you force it. No. It will go in so far. It won't fit in like this. Look. Well, these ones are spot on. This one won't go in. So yeah, they might be half decent, these Chinese fake ho things, but they don't work too well with other companies.